Before Travis Bainan adopted the nickname Candyman, before he was hailed as Australia's version of Dan Bilzerian, before he felt the wrath of the world's gaze after walking his wife around on a dog leash, Travis Bainan grew up middle class in Brisbane, Australia. He aspired to become an Australian football player, but a back injury it kept him from taking the field. After that, he became a high-end fashion model, and he married Miss World. They've since gotten divorced, and he's remarried. My name's Michael McCrudden, talking about Travis Bainan. His life prior to fame, here for you on Before They're Famous. Travers Bainan was born in Melbourne, Australia in 1972. His parents, Trevor and Sandra, they set up Free Choice Tobacco in 1991. The company has since become extremely profitable and they have over 200 locations in Australia. Before Travers inherited the business, he spent his youth growing up in Victoria and Queensland. He attended a Catholic boys school in Brisbane Southside known as Claire Vox College. In his youth, he was said to have been a real sports guy. He was also a bit of a troublemaker. A guy who went to school with him revealed to the media outlets that they thought that Travers was a bit of a boogan, which is like an Australian slang term for lower class, someone who's a little rough around the edges. Also he had a mullet. In his teens, Travers transformed physically. He was drafted to the North Melbourne Kangaroos for the 1989 preseason, but suffered a debilitating back injury. He was traded to the Brisbane Lions, but once again that injury it held him back. That was the end of his AFL career. He then began to focus on work as a model and began traveling the world. He was working in Australia, Europe, and the US. He wore brands including Levi Jeans, Machino, Valentino, Canali, Paul Smith, and Calvin Klein. He modeled comfortable looking full body tracksuits for department stores. He even stripped off for a Vodka Cruiser 2005 calendar. He booked a lot of high end gigs. He worked with Versace, they did a shoot out in Milan. He also worked with Raw Element, it's a fragrance and that one was shot in New York. While traveling the world, he met his first wife, Ninabeth Leal, an industrial engineer student from Venezuela who had recently won the title of Miss World in 1991. The two married and Ninabeth gave birth to two children. There was Valentino and Luciana and then their marriage it kind of fell apart. Travers then moved to the Gold Coast where he built his $3.75 million six bedroom party pad. Outside of these gates, you're a social leper. Inside these gates, you're a damn legend and we love you. He has since married his second wife, Taisha, with whom he has two kids. I met Taisha when she was 18 and three months. <laughs> He recently adopted the handle of Candyman on Instagram and he's broadcasting what his lavish lifestyle is like through the app. And people are scratching their heads going, I don't know if I love or I hate this guy. A lot of people hate him. I, I think it's kind of cool. Although the dog walking of the wife, well that one's, uh, he might have went a little too far. I mean even Dan Bilzerian was upset. Anyway guys, the rest of the story, you know the story because this is Before They Are Famous. My name is Michael McCrudden, thanks for watching the video. Also be sure to subscribe to this channel. I do celebrity biographies on a whole lot of people, a lot of internet celebrities. We did one on Dan Bilzerian, we did one on Jen Selter, Epic Meal Time, PewDiePie, Jenna Marbles, a lot of people. So be sure to subscribe, check out those other videos and I'll see you guys in the next one.